Well, we saw what went through in the last match. Hopefully, Indy's all right after this painful landing. Back first against the cell wall and then head first. Again, with no protection whatsoever. Face first against the with a harsh landing against the apron. So, hopefully, Indy's all right. Nightmare then, pull, of course, picked up the victory after that painful encounter. And there was darkness involved in this pinning attempt somehow. I don't know what went down there, but focusing on with the show still needs to go on, no matter if Indy is in the hospital or even worse, I, I, we still don't know. But what we do know, however, is the next match will be for the NXT Women Championship, the highest price from our, from our women and the entire NXT roster, so highest price for all of them. Mandy Rose, former champion, shall try her best to get, regain the title for Markel Gonzalez. Uh, who uh, got regained the title of Mandy after losing it because of Coda and shenanigans by Mandy and in the first place and now Raquel regained the title uh, Raquel regained the title and now it's Mandy's time perhaps to even the score with regaining title from each other and um, also for this match Kota Kai and the Inabuka band from ringside if they sh show up whatsoever they will get uh, fired from NXT and the WWE but that's what our board of the directors announced and a very fair announcement um, because teammates uh, we saw them earlier clash the uh, Inabuka and Kota Kai and Kota got the victory and of course Kota is uh, the friend and teammate of Raquel and Mandy is friend and teammate is, is uh, Dana Brooke of course just to let you know what we saw in the up following weeks in this rivalry in the storyline rivalry and now we have a ladder match for the title which could be said that the odds are slightly before a blonde uh, bombshell Mandy Rose uh, but we also saw powerhouses winning money in the bank matches which are even ha harder to get than in one one competition because it could be Raquel dominating the match, destroying Mandy Rose with a power advantage over her opponent, a clear power advantage with her, also her dangerous Tirana bomb. She could uh, then climb the ladder and get the title. I mean, we saw Kane and Otis with Money in the Bank, so who uh, had similar fate, even uh, had a challenge to obtain in Money in the Bank ladder match where they had seven opponents, and now Raquel just has one, so a yeah, slightly disadvantage for her, but. Hey, everything's possible in the WWE, that's an old saying, and it goes for this match as well as we avoid. This bastard, bastard always caught me off guard. And now disappearing into the shadows, <laughs> shadow realm or whatever. Well, it might beat them up or not. <laughs> as they come both long Sherman. But she's not so. She can't outpower Raquel. I think. So here comes Mandy Rose, former women's champion. And it was the best decision she ever made to return to NXT, becoming NXT women's champion. And she was champion for a long, long time before Raquel, Raquel regained the title of her. And yeah, now it's Mandy's time to shine again, perhaps, here tonight. We will find it out together. And, but Mandy seems to be happy, seems to be. seems to be very, very good mood, actually. Despite losing the title at the last pay-per-view, at our first pay-per-view, so to speak. Puts up her go goods to show for the entire universe who dislike her because of her actions. But I think I hear some, some cheering by some weirdos, perhaps. But she's not just a beautiful woman, she's also very good inside the ring. And that's why she was an NXT Women Champion before. And sadly, that's the only title she won. She and Sonya should have won the NXT Women, uh, the WWE Women's Tag Team Champions, in my opinion. No matter if they were part of Absolution or after that, as far as I desire, but yeah. It is how it is. As there comes the current NXT Women Champion, Aguil Gonzalez, on her way. It's her time to shine as Mandy, awaiting her inside the ring. Do, 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 do. As many trash talking there, the raiding giant, the powerhouse for Kay Gonzalez is. As Raquel, perhaps, was thinking about the sheep shot for Mandy. Now, webcom for the band, there we go. For the right hand for Mandy. Now, lifting her up. How is she in doing such a thing? But doesn't matter. What is what a slam there? And Mandy stomped to the arm as well. Move there by Mandy. Oh, power and Raquel. I never thought this would be the case. Possibly the case. Or the headbutt from Raquel, though. As Raquel elbow drop on Mandy. 
messing with the storm though. But man, he couldn't get back to our feet immediately. But shocking! Uh, what an STO! After putting Raquel's own momentum again to after try to hit Manny with a clover in there. Watching leg sweep, however, from Raquel. And now looking for another elbow. Drop. And Big Mommy Cool delivers. Can Big Mommy Cool defend the title later tonight? That's a big question. A big question. <laughs> As Manny ejecting her from the ring. As Raquel also from a woman's tag team champion alongside the Kodakai. As Raquel now waits for Mandy. And now a power wing. Drone bombshell of this power slam right there. It had press the power slam. That's like Goldberg does his jack hammer. That's what it remind me of. As like has issues to bring Mandy back inside the ring because of the cage and then again, maybe they like Mandy too much. Thanks to the back of the head of Mandy though. Who will win this ladder match here? Yeah. As like Kevin kicks and strikes to Mandy. To the form indeed there. Big mommy cool is fired up. So many watches God sleeper slam. Big mommy cool dominating so far. Close line. Find its mark. And now Raquel with an elbow drop to Mandy. And a barrage of strikes now. Look at how Raquel goes with this. Another strike yet again. Kick to the midsection of Mandy. What has he in mind? Looking for power bomb position. It's Raquel fired up that she is. Another barrage of strikes here. Now lifting her up yet again. Now powering her with a double choke bomb here. What well, a choke slam by when you idiot. What a choke bomb, dumbass. It's Raquel powering up Mandy as well in power bomb position. And power bomb to the outside. Like taking out the trash as Raquel is fired up. Can she call me? I'm not so sure about this. Oh, no, what la a harsh landing for Manny on the outside, not so harsh as Indies, but previous match, but still. As Ma uh, Raquel didn't let go, put her up. Perhaps a go is special about to come. Oh no, it's a submission. It's not a goalie bump, goalie special. That is. It's Mandy with the arm drag, avoiding da even further damage by the submission. And I was wisely. Swipping Raquel against the steel steps as Raquel back to her feet tried to attack Manny but Manny didn't realize was quick on the ring and hit Raquel with the ladder it's all legal in this match don't have to like it but it's all legal as Manny tried to get the better of Raquel somehow some way Raquel powers out hit her with a close line now looking for something big on Manny here perhaps and now strikes again but Manny blocks the attack in the time slaps her right in the face I don't know if that was a good idea but kicks in the corner for Mandy however and now Mash, smashing Raquel's face in the turnbuckles and now punches to the chest of Raquel and now storms in the corner stomping up big the mommy cool and now using her own power into alley -oop. I'm surprised by this power where does she take the power from I don't get it but kick to the back the soccer ball kick but Raquel back to her feet lifting Mandy up and down she goes with a big power slam and now another elbow to her find this mark Barrage of them this time. Raquel, three times. Elbow drop there to Mandy. Looking to kick to the midsection. Another power bomb is about to come. Whatever's playing here can't be good. And she delivers to the liking of the crowd. Really behind Big Mommy Cool here. Strikes on Mandy here. But Mandy with the reversal. And so is Raquel. What a close line. Battle of Mandy there. Now lifting her up on her shoulders. Try to power bump her out of the ring yet again and she delivers. But Raquel. Yeah, her hopes indeed slipping away. Mandy might have been done for already. As, Man as Raquel looking for the Tohana bomb on the outside. But she's not done yet. She wants to get every revenge she can on Mandy. And now with strikes and kicks and strikes yet again as she's not done yet. Dominating Mandy. That's easier said than done. Kick to the midsection. Lifting up for another goalie. Special. 
And she forced her to tap out even though that doesn't win at a match, but still can put up so much damage on Mandy Rose. And she wants to inflict so much damage on her for everything she's done to and Mandy's tapping as her Keller release it, but it doesn't matter if she taps, match continues as Mandy back to her feet somehow. So tough that she is, and again had cross goes Raquel into the steel step, but Raquel is tough herself as well as Mandy. A huge reversal with hip toss yet again using agility advantage, drop kick to the face to Raquel and losing Raquel in momentum yet again against her, but now trash talking to Raquel and Raquel back to her feet. Mandy didn't realize to the lacking of the crowd, Raquel back to her feet. Umpa big power slam and she delivers again. Crowd is so behind Raquel, and who can blame them? Not me. As Raquel looking for another Trana bomb. Can she deliver? Yes, she does. Could be all over for Mandy. One more time, one more time, shining the crowd. And Raquel have not a, no problem of giving the crowd what she wants, but she had other plans. First, sending Mandy some payback into the steel steps herself. And now looking for another big Tuchana bomb, which might finish it all off. Super power there from Raquel. And now Raquel, that's why she's a champ indeed, Michael. And now climbing the ladder, but she has problems. And of course, she's slower. She's slower than uh, Mandy because of having more weight to carry. And now she got her hands on the tile. Can she retain it after four Tukana bombs on Mandy Rose already? Uh, Mandy back to her feet on the outside. I don't know. I don't think Raquel can realize because she has her eyes and her hands on the tile. But can she unhook it? It takes long time because it's easier said than done to unhook the tile. As Mandy tried to get Raquel off the ladder with strikes, but Raquel fighting back. Who will win this? Be this. Mandy with reversal as it looked like they Raquel has Mandy off the ladder. But Mandy strikes and got Raquel off the ladder instead. And Mandy now has her hands on the tile. Can Raquel get back to her feet though? She does, but she has problems though. She has problems herself, Raquel climbing. As Mandy doesn't realize, still got hands on the title. But Raquel now gets down off the ladder, changing her plans here. And bringing Mandy down even with even more force than before. And now Raquel has put slam there, awfully landing for Mandy. Hopefully she is alright. As Raquel with kick to the midsection of Mandy. And another half of a slam here. Matt slam yet again as Raquel fired up. Yet again. Looking to finish Mandy once and for all here. Another Tejana bomb should do the job done for me. Mommy cool. But Mandy's so tough. And it's not easy for Raquel in this let out much situation as we start climbing slowly. Big opportunity indeed for Big Mommy Cool. Second from victory indeed here. Big Mommy Cool. Can she get it on? Mandy back to her feet. Can Mandy get somehow put an end to Raquel here? It's Mandy. Got Raquel. Got her down and out. That's how tough Mandy is. Raquel could be done for. But Raquel back to her feet. As Mandy escapes the ladder, she's too scared for Meg Mommy, but slapped to the face though, she might anger Raquel. As climbing the ladder, but Raquel with so much anger, she just pushes the ladder though. And Mandy fell off the ladder. But Raquel tried to close on her, Mandy outpowering her, put her down with a power slam. After went to so many power slams already by Mandy, and there's a by Raquel, and what a need for Mandy. But Man Mandy doesn't pick up the ladder, she's attacking the leg of Raquel, will be smart for Mandy. And soccer by kick in the back, but why wasting time after this knee? I would have climbed the ladder after the knee, after this big knee strike. Ty could be in reach for the blonde bombshell, can she regain the tile here? She had her hands on the tile and could be all over. It could be all over, but Raquel is about to get back to her feet. Raquel is back to her feet, pushing away the ladder. And get Mandy on her shoulder, electric chair. Wow, the crowd is so nuts. And who can blame them because of what they showed you they seen. What a close line for Raquel yet again. Another elbow drop. Finds a mark and another barrage of ever swipe to Mandy's chest. Maybe she should pick another outfit, maybe for some sort of protection with this harsh elbow drops there. Hard elbow drops there. Got swooped in the corner, that's so much force that she collapsed and her palms to the back of the head. 
And the stomp to the arm as well. And now Arkel picking up, putting a power to good use. No, Mandy, reversal agility coming in play yet again. Powerful agility is all match between Raquel and Mandy. Kick to the midsection. Look, uh, Mandy's looking for the chicken wing gut buster, and she delivers almost onto the ladder. Almost, but almost doesn't count as Mandy. What has she in mind? Picking up Raquel for what? Picking up for what? To swap outside of the ring, that's smart for Mandy. But Mandy following her, what's her plan? I don't know, but Raquel back to her feet, returning to the ring, and so is Mandy. Mandy picking up. How she delivers power slams to Raquel is beyond me. I mean, Raquel is so much more powerful than Mandy, but it doesn't matter. And we land the striking of Mandy to the face of Raquel and picking up the ladder once again. Will this be over? Will this be enough to put Raquel away? As Mandy set up the ladder, Mandy has her hands on the title again. Can Raquel stop her? I don't know. Mandy unhooks it. Mandy regained her title, but what a bang of a match this ladder match was. A full highlight wheel on match, in my opinion. Wow. What a spectacle the fans in Canada witnessed and everybody watching at home. The hip toss reversed on the outside by Mandy. Then this goes special where Mandy tapped out and it looked like that Drake dominating her way to a win with the Tejana bombs on the outside. But then Mandy with the knee and maybe that was the difference man make as much as the chicken wing gut buster here tonight. As Mandy once again. As for the second time in her career, Mandy reached the height of NXT Women's Division by regaining her NXT Women's Championship. Wow! And we are not even close of being done because the next match awaits and it will be for the tag titles from the maids perspective of the, the brothers Sasha and Big Sasha tried, unde who are undefeated at this point, try their best against Imperium's Fabian Eichner must have a to get the titles out of Imperium's clutches.